I've had lots of great teachers and mentors over the years. Because I think back, maybe one that had one of the greatest influences on me was one that I think was problematic, but I learned a lot from that experience. It's when I was in fourth grade, uh, every Friday we would take a spelling test in class. There was a class of maybe 30 students. And the next Monday we'd come in and we would rearrange our desks based on how well we had performed on the previous Friday's spelling test. And at the time, it was something that I saw as a type of challenge, that I wanted to be in the first row every week. And I was excited to be in the first row you know, every week. But the more I thought about that approach, and over the years, I came to appreciate how problematic that was. And I think it influenced me in many ways. It was problematic not just for the kids who were stuck in the last row of performing poorly, but also very problematic for the kids that were in the first row, who saw it as important to be in the first row. I think that's influenced the way I think about all the work I do now. Uh, I think right now it's so important to me when I think about learning and education, I don't want it to be a competition where students are competing against one another. And I don't want it to be a matter of students being offered some extrinsic reward, a prize where they're trying to get in the first row or to get some other prize. I want to be coming from themselves, from their own passions. Uh, when I teach classes, I don't want to give grades. I want students to work on things not for the grade, but for things they really care about. When we design websites for kids, like our Scratch website, we don't want to give prizes and awards and badges, but have kids show up the projects that they're proud about. So as I go through creating new courses and activities and technology for kids, I sometimes think back about those experiences in fourth grade of what I don't want to do to make sure that kids have you know, creative learning experiences where they can really live up to their full potential.